So a quick explanation of how the all language pairs versus a specific language pair settings work in Studio 2015. They actually work this way in 2009, 2011, 2014 and 2015. So the same thing that I'm going to show you now will apply to them all. So to check, you make sure your project is active and you click on your project settings. And this tells you the settings for this specific project. You then click on your language pairs, all language pairs, and look in the translation memory and automate the translation settings. Now in there you can see this project is a multilingual project, so I've got lots of languages in here. And in this first window, this second box down here, it says language pairs using different translation providers, and it's empty. That tells me now that all of these individual language pairs are using the settings from my all language pairs, not the specific ones. And if I was to click on a specific one, it says down here that the settings are taken from all language pairs, and that would apply to each one of these languages. If I wanted this particular language pair to have different settings, so maybe different search settings or different penalties or different filters to all the other languages in my project, then all I would do is I would say use different translation providers for this language pair. And when I check that, I get a warning, first of all, telling me that this could override my settings. I say yes. And it then brings in the translation memories that were relevant to that particular language pair and the message about the settings coming from all language pairs disappears. And if I go back into the all language pairs, you can see now that down here, whereas this was empty previously, now it has the details of the specific language pair that is not using the settings that are in here. That's the way you tell and that's the way it works. So this is really only useful or it's only really useful to not use all language pairs. If you have multiple languages in your project and you want to have different settings for one of the languages than you do for the others, which you might well do depending on the languages. But I hope that helps.